these two girls came up when I went through the, these are the seven symptoms of a curse that Derek Prince talked about. And these two girls came up, they'd be in their early 20s. I think they were twins actually, from memory. And they were weeping. And I said, well, what do you need from the Lord? And they said, you know that list, we could tick every one of those seven in our family. And that really, that almost floored me because I've never heard that from anybody before. And I, I said, look, I can do a sort of first aid prayer with you now, but I'm leaving first thing in the morning to another city. So can I put you in touch with the host pastor here? And, and they said, well, we go to another church. And I said, that's okay. He can make contact with your pastor and you can deal with it between them. So I connected them and, and uh, arranged that. Six weeks later, I got an email from that pastor and he said, you remember the two girls that we did, we were going to arrange some ministry. He said, we did, the, the other pastor and I did it with them together. And since then, this is in only six weeks, since then, 42 members of their uh, family have come to the Lord. What? It's like a cork in a bottle. When the curse is broken or shifted, uh, dealt with, then suddenly there's a bit of an ability to understand.